What is going on, dudes? My name is Welcome back to Final Mega Shadows Shadow Soul Engine. In the last episode, we did the final two actual battle missions of Celica's story, because uh, we cannot do anything more with Arm. Arm. Arm right now, um, because it's still blocked off here, and we're going to enter the Duma Tower. So let's get started. Um, oh, it's an actual dungeon. Dang. Okay, I um, guess we'll just organize and go. I didn't actually think this would be a dungeon. The tower is massive, oppressive, like Duma's power given form. What lies beyond the quest for ever greater power? Who knows? Perhaps that answer lies at the tower's peak. I got a money bag. Alright, I definitely hear stuff. Sneak attack! Atlas will probably be able to become a golden knight after this. I don't know how much fighting he'll even have to do. I just realized I didn't actually check and see who I'm bringing. So, let's hope that my lower level units are on <laughs> with this party. Uh, so that they can get some much needed XP. And Celica levels up. She learned Excalibur. I don't know why exactly you'd attack Celica when there are several units you could have attacked that can attack you from range, so. No skin on my nose. Ooh, treasure. Money bag. This reminds me a lot of the Relic Castle. No, Dragon Spiral Tower. That's the that's the one I'm thinking of. Water of what? Speed. Ooh. Who has low speed? Valbar is very low speed, so Valbar is going to get him. Okay. Let's see, where does this lead? There's a Mila idol in the Duma Tower. Oh, it's headless. Oh. Yeah, that kind of makes sense. Hey, Duma Moss! Now we can go back and do whatever the heck that other thing is. Duma Tower isn't far now. How are you feeling, Antis? Are isn't you scared? Far now. We're inside of it. Of course it. you'd say that. You're as strong as they come. But don't forget... You have me and everyone else at your back, okay? I'm not suggesting you don't believe in us. It's more like... Sometimes it's like you're running off ahead without us, and it's... Lonely. I don't know. Sorry. I'm not doing a great job of explaining this. It's he missed one, crit the second. Oh man, he's so close to becoming a Golden Knight. Where you go, Conrad. Sony levels up to level 12. Oh yeah, she didn't level up in again. After I had to restart the last chapter. We're gonna let Conrad get up to Paladin. And I'm gonna go back to the Mila statue and bring him up to Golden Knight. You can't hit what can see you coming. Alright, Conrad gets to become a Golden Knight. It's all the statue is also armless. I find it funny that there's one at all inside of the Duma Temple. Duma Tower. Yo, look at that! That is so cool! Wow, he look he that actually looks really good. As your will commands, Miller. Sweet. This is gonna be tough. Let us proceed. Atlas will become a golden knight here soon. Your strength. This might level him up. Yes! Alright, now we have another pat we have another gold knight. We'll go uh give him his glass change here in a minute. Atlas is becoming a golden knight. Let's see what he actually looks like. Because he's got the black armor, which is different from everyone else. Look at that. Looking good. Not sure I get what's going on here. But leave it to me regardless. Find peace and slumber. They should have made Conrad's armor pure white like it was before. Rather than making it this olive green, it's er. It's sort of like a pistachio olive green. It's hard to. It's it's weird. I like it though. It's not bad. It's just I wish they had kept his armor white or cream. It would look good. And S levels up to level three. Cool stuff. Okay. Here's the side that I didn't see before. That's just a lot to explore here. Oh, treasure. The Lady Blade. What? Sir, the doubles the power in female hands. Okay, well, you're going. You're definitely getting that. <laughs> That's awesome. I'm excited to see what that actually looks like. 
Oh, okay, this is a what I assume to be the boss. Before we continue, watch please. Oh, is that a girl? You should have that looked at. You should have that looked at. Please dodge. Dang it. How much damage is this gonna do? 18. Not bad. I can deal with that. Well, she missed both attacks. I didn't really get to see what the blade looked like. Oh, there's specters. I didn't realize that, but Johnny levels up. What do you think of this? Goodbye. Look pretty good, yeah? Way to go, Jesse. Level 9. I don't remember if it's level 10 that, hmm. uh, the Myrmidons can become whatever. And Sonya took down the boss. She's also going to level up to level 13. Alright, let's see what this Lady Blade looks like. She missed, and I didn't see it again. I didn't realize how low of a chance she had to hit. It's just a rapier. Shouldn't you get healed? It just sort of looks like, I mean, I don't think there's anything special about it, except that it's a rapier. I don't know. It just makes me think Asuna. Alright, well, that's good, S. She got long arch, or whatever it said. Sweet, we did it. Valbar levels up. First time in, like, a long time for him. Chronicles this shit, bro. That was so difficult. There's so many fights we had to do. Oh my gosh. I can't go anywhere else. I just gotta talk to him. Oh yeah. I was wondering why there's no sound. I forgot I muted it, so... Because I was watching videos, so... Let's talk to Jedi. Impressive. I did not expect all of you to make it here. Enough talk. I will see Mila now. Where is she? <laughs> Such impatience is unseemly, your highness. And at any rate, I'm afraid Mila isn't here. She's underground, on Lord Duma's altar. 
I don't understand. I can grant you sight if you so desire. Gaze now upon your precious Earth Mother. Oh no! What have you done? She... she's been turned to stone! Look there! Piercing her brow. Is that... Falchen? You have a keen Falchen eye, sounds boy. so dumb. It is indeed the Divine Blade. You will likely doubt me when I say this, but that was Miller's doing. The moment Emperor Rudolph sealed her power, Miller sealed away Falchen. Do not ask me her motive in this, for I understand it not. There's one person but you no can remove it. no force in this world now remains which can harm Lord Duma. She's left her children to their fates. <laughs> no, this is impossible. Bella, I don't understand. Why would you do this? Have you truly forsaken us? <laughs> Your lamentations are wasted, child. If you truly wish for her release, you know what must be done. You must offer up your soul to Lord Duma. Did he just say what I think he said? Offer her soul? Oh, gods! Selica, no! He wants to turn you into a witch! That is a really bad idea! <sighs> There's no other choice. Without the Divine Dragon's power, all of Valentia's people are lost. And the only thing that can save the dragons is the soul of a brand bearer. So, that's what you couldn't tell us. <sighs> Aunties, you made me a promise, remember? You promised not to throw your life away again. I'm sorry, Conrad. I'm sorry, everyone. Please forgive me. I can't tell you how much it means to me that we've come so far together. Aunties! You lot are no longer necessary. Be gone to wherever you will. Huh? <sighs> no! Calm yourself, your highness. I've merely sent them below. As for your preparations, I fear they will take some time yet. You can while away the hours here, watching the boy suffer. Oh, no! What? I don't believe it. That last quake cleared out some of the rocks. The road's passable again. Goodness! What a stroke of serendipity! Come now, Om. Let's hurry across before the next tremor hits. Uh, right. Hmm? Is something the matter? No. I mean, it's just... It feels strange is all. A little too convenient. It's almost like I can feel someone's intent behind it. An intentional rock slide? Really, Alm, you worry too much. Now, chop chop. One mustn't dawdle. I'll await you on the far side. <sighs> I don't like this at all. I hope you're all right, Celica. <laughs> God dang it. All right, well, I'm going to... What, I'm going to end it here? I don't know how long... This is going to be a short episode, I think. I just don't... I don't know. I don't really want to do the next fight. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to save here. And I'm going to go... And we'll see if there's story. If there's story, I will wait till the next episode. If it's just a battle and against some random general or something like that, then I'll do it. Okay. Um, she ain't no freaking <laughs> black-haired lolly no more. God, what the hell? Why? Again, why do you attack my archer? It's like dumb or something. Because you could literally just moved out of the way and attacked Matilda, but no, you decide to attack. That's so weird. It doesn't make any sense to me. All right, Claire's gonna crit. Indeed, you should be honored. Good job, Claire. Proud of you. Oh, I like that. Matilda's so good.
Good job, Clive. Good job. Hey, it was you or me. Indeed, Python. Good job, my friend. Actually, I was thinking about it. I, we have some supports that we did that I skipped through. Um, I did have them on camera originally, and then I just decided I'd ignore the part of the recording because there was so much... Like, I had so many attempts, and I had so such long footage of just attempting. So it literally was just like Valkyria Chronicles all over again. So, I don't know. It was just crazy. Actually, the guys at the bottom, I wanted to stay behind and take on the other dudes at the bottom. I should have done that. Okay, you're going to attack Tobin. Tobin's smiling, so that's going to do nothing to him. He's going to dodge, too. Go on. Give me your best shot. You're bad. <laughs> All right, they are going to attack Cliff, which is unfortunate. Okay, well, actually, I don't know how much Cliff will do. He should take a lot of damage. He did. Way to go, Cliff. I was thinking that uh, we'd be clogged up and we wouldn't be able to get any people to help us. Way to go, Cliff. I'm anxious to actually see what Celica's army is uh, rated. Because, dude, those ten I brought into battle with me... Freaking hell, they gained so many levels. Nice. Alright, Tatiana. She levels up to level 3 too. That makes sense. 3 2. Alright, Python. Son of a gun. You miss both. Straight up, my luck in this game is bullshit. I hate it. Can we walk across the river? Or how are we going to get across? I don't know. I guess we'll see. Claire can get across, but... I need more than Claire to be able to get across. Just click. Crit Claire. God dang it. There we go. Thank you. Okay, I don't know how Clive's resistance is still one, but it was a good dodge there. You're gonna death on Clive. Ow, my dear. It's a good thing you can't hit him. Holy crap. Never mind. Come on, Cliff. Dodge or just somehow survive. Thank you. Oh, dear gosh. Yeah, Tantiana's gotta run and you physic on him. I need him. Y'all can fuck off now, thanks. Oh my, come on. And 40% chance, and Clive goes down. That's gonna make things super tough. I don't know how, but she can get across the bridge here even though it's broken, so... Maybe it was all just about a positioning or something. So that's fine. Uh, if you can crit and kill this dude, that'd be so nice, Claire. No, but if you can dodge... Except you do neither of those things, so that makes things so freaking stupid. Come on, Python. Better fucking kill him, Tobin. I need this. Way to go. My dude Tobin levels up to level 6. Steel shield. Okay. That's why he wasn't taking much damage. Done with you. Gray's gonna crit you just to rub it in your face. Damn, I'm good. You are. That was marvelous. Indeed it was. Okay. Well, these guys have javelin. Oh, okay. That's gonna do a good amount of damage to him. If you could have crit twice, that would have been so good. I don't understand why you're acting so happy about this. Thank you, that's why, because you were going to dodge. Okay. Thanks, Delthea. She levels up level 14. She can become a whatever soon. What is it? Priestess, yeah. That's what I like to see. Indeed it is. I will agree with that. Let's do their A support here. Delthea, guess what? Uh, what? I've finally made a friend, and it's Ulm. I asked him if we were friends, and he definitely nodded. 
I don't know many people who would answer that with a no, but, uh, good for you, I guess? Isn't it? Now, perhaps you'll finally let me set you on the right path. Not likely. Actually, here's my advice to you. Try starting a new conversation where the goal isn't to make the other person think just like you do. You'll make way more friends that way. Trust me on this one. I mean, I'd actually like to get to know you, but you make it so damn hard. I see. But in that case, what else is there to talk about? What else? Are you serious right now? Look, am I your adorable and magically omnipotent little sister or not? Well, yes. Oh, Lou, thank you! See, that's called a compliment. Now do more of that. Lay it on thick. Tell me I'm freaking amazing! Is this truly how normal people converse? Way to go, Alm. He levels up to level 7. Why did I use fire? I didn't mean to use fire. I'm, I don't know how. I meant to click X or Y, whichever button it is, and I clicked A. Frickin' fat finger day. God damn it. Okay, you're going for her. Thank you for dodging. Ooh, he'll be okay. That's gonna hurt, but we'll be all good. Ow! 20 freaking damage! Okay, you're gonna go for Lucas. Lucas has so much health, it's not gonna be much of anything to him. Please, Claire. Thank you. I really need her right now, so that's perfect. She dodged. All right. Well, she takes like nothing from the the stupid gargoyles, so that's nice. Silk's just fine with this. <laughs> like, do nothing. That's awesome. Okay. Thank God he fled. Okay, that makes things so much easier. How much damage do you do in one hit? All right. Well, you can survive technically. We do have two sages though. All right. I will eradicate you. Good job, Luthier. All right, Alm. Oh, yeah, he was too low to use death anyway. Sweet. I wonder how much health death actually ma talent. actually takes. Okay, who needs it? Claire does. I should have given it to Gray, in all honesty. Cause she's good for now. I'll take one of these guys and have Silk heal him up. That'll work. We're done! Good job, Lucas. You the man. Goodbye. Oh, come on! God damn it, Faye. 90% chance to miss and you still miss. Or 90% chance to hit and you miss. I hate you. You're lucky because we have two we have enough people up here to take up take these guys down. But beat ah if we didn't. Heal quickly. Oh, she'll be just fine. There's not much there's no one at the moment who can hit her. I just need you to take down this dude. Good job, Zook. That Zook. Yeah, that was I don't remember whose voice that was. All right, good job, Claire. I will admit, 99 damage is a bit of overkill, but... Another miss. Okay, good job, Faye. At least you didn't freaking die. I just want... I need Python to get in there and just literally shoot one of them in the face. Stupid freaking archer. We fought her, I think. Oh, Gray. Okay, that's fine by me. <laughs> Way to go, Ulm. I forgot you had the bow. Hang in there, Gray. Please dodge. 
Again, please. What chapter was that where he freaking did that? It was against the say. Where he freaking dodged all the attacks and survived. Oh my gosh. You are the man. I don't know why they're going all the way around to do this. Like, is there no openings to attack Gray? Because I feel like that'd be the smartest decision you can make. At least damage-wise. Python can't cross. Yo, that's bull. I also don't know why it wouldn't let me attack there. Because it... These guys were in the red. Alright, Matilda's gonna crit this witch, so this guy's gonna go. And... How much damage can Gray do to Hestia? Yeah, he doesn't have a good enough chance. I'm gonna let Tobin take him out. I just... I want Gray to stick around, because Gray's a valuable fighter. There we go. I've done nothing wrong. Yes, you did. You try to push your beliefs on other people. That's that's always wrong. Ambrosia. Some person wanted Ambrosia. No, some person could make Ambrosia. That's what it was. Oh my gosh! Please crit, player. Think. Oh, never mind. You don't even need to crit. That's good. Ugh, okay, that dude's gone. Alright, time to get our big armor boys in here and do some damage. What? And he misses. Why did... Oh my god, I hate that. No, I need Faye to get in here. Alright, good job there, Faye. Damn it. Some might go down at this point, I don't care. If you could dodge Gray. Yeah. And Faye ends the fight. I am bested. You fight well. Sweet. <sighs> okay. Cool. Thanks for the purse. Yeah, we have so much gold and so much nothing and nothing else. Yeah, that was. Next time. Ne I don't know what she was gonna say, but I don't care. Oh my gosh, that was freaking tough. Okay, now we're gonna really quickly go through these supports that I had to kind of skip through. We'll do Jenny and Sonia's B. Um, Sonia? Huh? I'm surprised to see you here. I thought you didn't like my type. Yeah, about that. I wanted to apologize. It was a rude thing to say. You don't have to apologize. It didn't bother me. Maybe not, but it bothered me. I said what I did because... You remind me of my mother. Okay, now I'm bothered. I'm nowhere near old enough to have a kid your age. No, it's not like that. It's been years since I last saw her. My mother, I mean. Years since she left me at the Priory. Ah. Uh. She was beautiful, just like you. And she always wore makeup as well. So seeing you makes me think of her. I'm sorry. Oh, you poor thing. Alright, and then we'll do their A. I haven't hey, seen this one. Um, hello, Sonia. Still not comfortable around me? Not completely, no. I'm sorry. It's alright. But I wanted to share something with you. I also grew up in a priory. Although it was my father who abandoned me. Is that true? Yes. And if I met a man who reminded me of him, I'd likely kick his face in. Fortunately, you don't come across those types too often. Anyway, my point is that you don't have to hold back with me. You're free to hate my guts as much as you like. Because I understand. No, actually, I... Um, I feel a little more comfortable after hearing what you said. Oh, that was quick. Well, in that case, 
I suppose we can be bitter together. <laughs> okay, Palin asks a sport. Hey, sis. Um, can I ask you something? This must be bad if you need to ask permission first. No, no, it, it's just... Look, maybe I'm wrong in, in just imagining it, but I'm curious... About... Is there a boy you like? <laughs> you know, you're in this army. What? I mean, it's such a wonderful group and full of really nice men. So if any of them caught your eye, I thought maybe I could set you up? Wow, I don't even know where to begin. We're not here to mingle and find a date, Est. There's no room for that now. I know you mean well, but be serious. <laughs> Sorry. Listen to me, Est. What makes me the most happy is being with you and Katria. You don't need to worry about anything except staying safe. Understood? Understood. Okay, Silica and Conrad's B. On tease. Everything all right? Uh, Conrad? What happened to your mask? I decided to stop wearing it when you're around. I mean, how could I keep it on after what you said last time? Oh, I was only teasing, Conrad. Please don't take it to heart. Even if you didn't mean it seriously, it's serious to me. Oh, come on, brother. Don't be like that. And they're A. On tease. Oh, I didn't know you were so close by. <laughs> <laughs> kind of funny how we keep running into each other like this, huh? This is hardly the time for idle chit-chat, Conrad. Everyone else is fighting their hardest, and we need to do the same. Why can't you be as sharp and dashing as when you were the masked knight? Wait, dashing? Dashing? Uh, one second. Any who dare lay a hand on my sister shall feel the sting <laughs> of my blade. <laughs> yes! That's the spirit. All right, and those are all the supports I'm pretty sure that I got um, during that little grind uh, through the freaking tower. So that's where I'm going to end this episode of Fire Emblem Echo Shadows Volante. If you, I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did like, appreciate it. In the next episode, we'll probably be doing the next two battles here. We can probably get both of them done in the next episode. We might be able to go into whatever this place is. Let's see, what is it called? What are we going to? We're going to the Regal Castle. So we might be able to get to the Regal Castle. But you never know. So, thanks so much for watching. I'll talk to you all later.